Yo, so what is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then let me introduce myself first. I am Gabriel Manuel, make videos about personal growth, finance, investing, and crypto. I also upload university vlogs and interviews people from all walks of life. Interesting? Then like my videos, click that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell for you to stay updated. Alright, let's begin. So in today's video, we'll be talking about Bitcoin's recent price drop you know what i'm saying like there's a huge price drop ng bitcoin ngayon and kung ano yung kinalaman ni Elon Musk dito but before we start disclaimer lang i am not a financial nor a personal growth advisor so please don't take my videos as professional advice all of these are just based on my own researches and my own experiences lang so i highly recommend pa rin to do your own research before diving into something completely new to you. Deal? Alright, let's begin. So yun nga guys, we'll be talking about the Bitcoin's recent price drop. Kasi we all know na last week, Bitcoin's price is around $59,000. Tapos ngayon, nag-drop siya into around $46,000 na lang. So if we do the math, that's more than 15%. In less than a week, you know what I'm saying? That's pretty insane, you know? So kapag i-stalk nyo si Kuya Elon, you know what I'm saying? So yun nga, if you go to Elon Musk Twitter, makikita nyo dun yung tweet niya about sa Bitcoin. So parang kinancel niya yung Bitcoin, ano ho? Kasi nalaman niya na it needs lots of energy to mine this crypto coin, this Bitcoin compared sa ibang altcoins kaya sinabi niya na hindi daw that environmental friendly yung bitcoin so wait anong connect um alam naman natin di ba na si Elon is like leaning towards greener tomorrow like you know alam naman natin na ang dami niyang project like Tesla which is an electric car tapos meron pa siyang SpaceX yung yung goal niya na doon na tayo titira sa Mars. Parang ganun. So, like, yung Bitcoin kasi, you know, sabi ko well ago nga na nangangailangan ito ng maraming energy to mine this crypto coin. And, on the other hand naman, Elon said something nice about Doji. Dogecoin. You know, meron siyang tweet about Dogecoin na sinasabi niya na nagpa-participate siya for the betterment of this altcoin. And um, yun nga, um, kung mapapansin natin this past few days, grabe yung increase ng value ng Dogecoin. While on the other hand, grabe yung decrease ng value ng Bitcoin. And I guess lahat tayo magkakasundo kapag sasabihin ko na malaki yung factor ng mga tweets ni Elon Musk sa galaw ng presyo ng mga crypto coins na to. Well, although merong contribution si Elon Musk sa paggalaw ng presyo ng mga crypto coins na to, well, given na yun, kasi nga whales, yeah, you know, isa siya sa malalaking investors, malalaking traders. I don't know. Matatawag natin siyang trader, investor, sa crypto world. Pero, there's a lot of, you know, market analysts crypto analyst, bitcoin analyst, may bitcoin analyst ba? There's a lot of analysts that are saying na hindi that much makakaapekto si Elon Musk sa bitcoin in the long run. Which makes sense din naman kasi nga um, bago lang si Elon Musk sa bitcoin eh. And kahit na hindi hindi that magkakatugma yung um, pananaw ni Elon Musk sa, you know, energy consumption ng Bitcoin. Pero the fact na ilang buwan pa lang si Elon Musk sa Bitcoin gives, you know, the, the right to say ng mga analyst na yon na no, Elon Musk, okay, okay, kung wala ka dito, kebs lang, Bitcoin can do on its own. I mean, Bitcoin can stand on its own, you know. So guys, what are your thoughts about this one? Wait, tinatanong nyo ako? Nakapag-disclaimer na ako, di ba? O, oh, sige, sige, sige. Well, for me, um, I should say na huwag tayong that mga mba, you know? Sabi nga nila, mayroon ako nabasa na 
kapag bababa yung presyo ng mga cryptocurrencies tsaka yung mga presyo ng stocks sa stock market, huwag tayong mangamba, huwag tayong mabahala, huwag tayong masad. Kasi sabi na nga ng iba na oh, bearish na bearish na ganun, sell nyo na para lessen yung lugi nyo. Pero for me, kapag ganyan kasi, I'll take that thing like um, market is on sale, you know. Pero ngayon, wala tayong pera eh. Huwag nyo skip yung ads guys, okay? Pero yun nga, um, I guess hindi naman tayo that mabahala because like um, gumaganon talaga yung market and we all know guys na hindi lang si Elon Musk yung whale dito sa Bitcoin hindi lang si Elon Musk yung whale dito sa crypto world world hindi lang si Elon Musk yung whale dito sa crypto world marami sila and like although nakakapekto siya pero I guess hindi that much you know what I'm saying so yeah I guess that will be it for now Guys, um, kung napapansin nyo, this is very raw, um, walang editing, I mean, walang gifs na lumalabas, walang zoom in, zoom out na lumalabas, walang transition na lumalabas, walang um, text, walang words na lumalabas, and everything, because like, um, part to sa mga videos na i-upload ko na medyo raw, but at the same time connected and related to my niche which is yun nga personal growth finance investing crypto and other interesting and fun stuff yeah i'll try my best to upload more than one video a week and um kasali na dito i mean kasali na ito sa videos na i-upload ko but Rest assured guys, makakakita pa rin kayo ng mga videos na yun nga, mara- may skits, um, meron yung si Boy Chismis. Yeah, hindi nyo pa yan siya nakita but in near future, i-introduce ko siya. Kasi familiar kayo yun sa, eh bakit nga gab, yung parang ganun-ganun. So yun, um, lalagyan natin siya ng better skits si Boy Chismis. Yes, Smith. Si Boy Chismis, tapos like, um, meron din tayong bagong character which is si Direk. Yun nga, um, mag introduce ako sa kanila in mga following vlogs. So, you better guys stay tuned on my channel. Yeah, that's it. Thank you so much guys for watching. Kung nakalearn kayo ng something new or like interested kayo sa topic ng channel na to, then don't forget to like and subscribe then guys kung may mga katanungan kayo suggestions and hopefully non-violent reactions then feel free to comment that in the comment section below thank you so much guys for watching and sana subaybayan niyo pa ako sa future journey ng buhay ko bye god bless everyone